it go was to take the whole thing a step further and why and how the uh, amount of uh, wheat or gluten in the diet affects the incidence of diabetes. We found a significant difference in the, the microbiome of uh, the mice which are fed a gluten-containing diet which get high incidence of diabetes versus uh, the microbiome of mice which have a low incidence of diabetes and which are uh, fed on a, a gluten-free diet. So this difference was, uh, again, statistically significant. Mm -hmm. And uh, so again, with the help of uh, some other collaborators, uh, we were able to further identify what are the actual, uh, how do the microbiome differ between the two, uh, between the two groups of mice. Mm -hmm. We found that certain bacterial species were enriched in mice which were fed uh, high uh, incidence, uh, uh, high incidence of diet Mm -hmm. whereas mice which were fed uh, a diet which is free of gluten. So there is a significant difference in the microbiome. Between those. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then uh, to again, uh, again uh, being in research, so again we wanted to prove that it is actually the gluten which again it causes uh, this effect. So what we did was that we added back gluten to that gluten-free diet. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So and then we were, so now the, uh, the mice which normally now which got low incidence of diabetes mm -hmm. because they were fed on a gluten-free diet, when you add back gluten, then they start getting a high incidence of diabetes. Mm -hmm. And uh, when we again analyze the microflora uh, or, uh, or the microbiome of those mice, now this microbiome was again different and mm -hmm. it was similar to the one in nod mice which have a high incidence of diabetes, mm -hmm. which again proves that it is the gluten in the diet mm -hmm. which could change the, which cause the change in microbiome, mm -hmm. which probably, uh, which resulted in, uh, in the low incidence of diabetes. Mm -hmm. We found a significant difference in the, the microbiome mm -hmm. of uh, the mice which are fed a gluten-containing diet, which get high incidence of diabetes, versus uh, the microbiome of mice which have a low incidence of diabetes and which are uh, fed on a, a gluten-free diet. Taking gluten out changes the bugs, and so maybe that change could be what's contributing to protection from diabetes, so especially this type 1 diabetes that occurs.